good, Nick. This is Nick Douglas for Adventures of a Sailor Girl at the beautiful Middle Harbour Yacht Club. Guido, congratulations. Another win for Transfusion in the Far 40 Nationals. Yeah, it's great. You know, it's, uh, it's an extraordinary regatta. It's an extraordinary class. We've had a lot of fun. We've enjoyed all the regattas up to this one. And this one, you know, just pushed the level again. And, and you know, that got us going. So it just made us dig deeper. And I don't know, for some reason, it all came together. And uh, it's not just luck, of course. You know, you create your own luck. We worked hard and um, you were very proud of the result. That's, that's fantastic to hear. And what a showing. I have to say, the picks from the start line, it looked amazing. Yeah, no, they were good. But there were some dodgy ones. We were over. <laughs> We were over once, and so we had to go back. We started last and yeah. came first in that race, actually. Oh so I gosh. said, "Well, that's okay." So we obviously wanted the we wanted to go right, and yep. we ended up going right. <laughs> Excellent, but it's so nice to see a resurgence in the far forty class in Australia. I have yeah. to say. Yeah, no, it's great, and it's great to have Lang back as well, and Marty. You haven't seen Martin Hill for a long time, yeah. so it's good to have all the old uh, campaigners and and push us hard. And then you know we've got, as you know, John Kostecki on board mm. for this regatta and then leading up to the worlds. And and John's a tough taskmaster, and you know he asked us to live and we lifted. And you lifted, yeah. yeah. yeah we well, there's, there's nothing else you can do, but, I mean, you guys sailed very, very well. Yeah, thank you. Thanks very much. We enjoyed it, and uh, and thank you very much to the Yacht Club. What a wonderful Yacht Club here, and oh. which of which I'm a member, of course. And, <laughs> and, you know, all the competitors, and particularly the guys that came from Melbourne, from Newcastle. Uh, you know, it's just so good to see these guys really enthusiastic. And and they're picking up wins as well. That's yeah. fantastic. You know, it shows that we're all beatable as if you, if you get your act together. Yeah, and the wins are shared around the board, but, I mean, having this quality of a fleet as well leading into the worlds yeah. next week that must be pretty good for you guys yeah no it will be but it'll be all on when the guys from the worlds uh, turn up you know we've got two american crews and one european and uh, two of them are world champions so that's that's when the you know the uh, the music stops and then we've got to figure out where we are exactly but uh, but you know that's that's racing and that's what excites us all as sailors yeah excellent thank you thanks nick no worries oh jeff carter hard day at the office yeah, hi Nikki. Yeah, it was uh, uh, unfortunately it was a Wesley, and I've never done any well, any good in a Wesley. In fact, I think I might have had you at one stage, Nikki, on the back of a boat in a Wesley too, if I, if I remember correctly. Yeah. Uh, on the first far forty that I had, so uh, yeah, it was a hard day at the office. Uh, mm. But still, you know, we know we can do it. We were in second place up until uh, up until uh, today, so uh, we thought, well, that's pretty good to be in front of the two pro teams, particularly Kokomo and, uh, yeah. and the State Master. So. Yeah, and saying pro teams, you are the first Corinthian. That's pretty good showing, hey? Yeah, that's a good that's a good showing for uh, coming into the World Championships, and uh, obviously, uh, you know, it's a. It's a good. Pl it's better to be in that position yeah. than not be in that position. Uh, we've still got some improvement to do. We're, uh, you know, we're getting around the track okay, uh, and the sails are quite quick, so we're quite happy with where we are from from that perspective. Uh, we think that it's. Uh, we did well in pit water. We did it. We did poorly in the states. We did well in the nationals. So we think we'll do poorly in the pre worlds, and we'll be right for the worlds. <laughs> Perfect. You're timing it well. <laughs> yeah, that's one on, one off. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But I mean, that said, you've been in the class for a little while now, and it's so nice. It's it's really healthy in Australia at the moment. Yeah. Look, um, I've been in the class now since 2006, mm -hmm. or the end of 2006, and uh, you know we've had uh, we've had ups and downs as far as that goes, as far as numbers are concerned. But everybody's sort of very keen at the moment. Um, you know, it was great to have Aberdeen, who was our sponsor in the in the formative years from 2012, and I think a, a new sponsor would certainly get a lot of a lot of uh, airplay, and, and that again with uh, all the owners and that that we've got for coming into 2016. Yeah, definitely. I love that about the Far 40 class. The owners really get together, and you really care about what's happening, and you're directing it all the time. Yeah, well, because it's an owner-driver rule and it's an owner's class, you know, we all want to make sure that the owners are actually enjoying themselves out there. We're having fun, and if we're having fun, we'll get the boats out, and it's always in our own interest to, to make sure that when we get out there with a the fleet that we try and get, you know, seven, eight or nine, and having ten at the Nationals was great. That is unbelievable, and it's, it's only, you know, giving us a taste of what's to come next week. Yep, it'll uh, it'll certainly be all on next week. Uh, there won't be any uh, it won't be uh, any give or take. It'll just be all take. Excellent. <laughs> well, well, as you said, you're going to have a good one. So um, I'll see you there. Thanks, Nick, and uh, thanks for the interview. No worries. This is Nick Douglas for Adventures of a Sailor Girl. Martin Hill, you slipped into third today. Yes, lucky. We were lying fourth yesterday. Yesterday was a worst day on the water. Uh, we had uh, leading at one of the races. Had a second race of the day. And our spinnaker unfortunately went over the bow, so uh, we went from first to last. But uh, I think it, it reinforces how important it is to get uh, race practice in. Uh, we hadn't raced since the Worlds in September, so I think that showed this weekend. So disappointing, but it was nice to get uh, our crew work back today. So that was probably the main thing, just taking the 
lessons from yesterday to work harder, so it was good. Yeah, it's, it's interesting, you've put in a lot of work in the, in the past few years, especially overseas. Have you got the same team on board for this regatta? Uh, we've got the core of the team. We've got uh, Darren Jones yeah. and, and Jason on board and, and James um, Corey. But uh, we've had some new uh, additions and uh, also Lisa joined us, uh, my Yay! wife, for uh, this weekend, which is wonderful. She did a wonderful job. Oh, I and, bet she did. So I'm very proud of her. Oh, no, that's amazing. But, I mean, you've been in, involved with Far 40 in Australia for a long time. I know you're a former class president. Is it nice for you to see that many boats back out there on the race course again for an Aussie Nationals? Absolutely. And it was great seeing Matt Allen, you know, the spectator boats yeah. out there and, and Sam Hill. And that no, was good. No, it's, 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 uh, the fleet is very strong. And, and I can say, sailing against the Corinthians and the professionals over in the world, this fleet is an excellent fleet. Yeah. There's a, there'd be a, it's going to be a great world coming up with this calibre of this fleet. No, I can't wait. I'm very excited and I know a lot of people will be because gosh they look good when you've got a few far 40s on the start line. Yes and it's amazing how close it is too as well so uh, yeah. We, they're not dinghies. No they're not dinghies yeah. But it's amazing there was a very a great level of professionalism. Uh, no no T-bones and, and no one injured so and, and as you know it's very strong winds today so it, it was uh, there was uh, a lot of talent being shown out there today. Excellent. Well, congratulations to you for slipping into third, and good luck for the world, eh? Hey? Yoo-hoo! <laughs> Go a straight, Martha. Yes. Thank you. Thanks, Thanks. Nikki.